Hello and welcome to this episode of the English Idioms series. In this video we're focusing on the idiom to look out for number one. First we'll have a think about what this idiom means and then we'll spend a few moments focusing on some interesting pronunciation features. Finally, we'll have a couple of examples to finish. So to look out for number one, taking our definition from the Cambridge Online Dictionary, we have to do what you think is best for yourself and not care about other people. To look out for number one, I suppose that you could just say to be selfish. So thinking about pronunciation, then we've got three main features that we can look at. Uh, starting with the weak form of to, which is t at the beginning there. And then we've got um, a potential connection because look ends in a k and out ends in a vowel. That can become look out, look out. It almost sounds like one word. And then finally, we've got that word for which would, because we're not emphasising it in this idiom, becomes weak, f, f. So that's a t, look out, and f. And when we build the idiom back together, to look out for number one. To look out for number one. So let's look at it in a couple of examples then. I know she needs help, but I have to look out for number one. His personal motto is look out for number one. OK, so thanks very much for watching. I hope that was useful. Um, if you found it useful, feel free to hit the like button or click to subscribe. There are lots of other idioms, so check out the playlist and see which ones you like the look of if you've got any requests leave a note in the comments below. Thanks for watching and have a great day.